Richo, a reward for some um, pretty impressive performances in the Big Bash? Uh, yeah, it seems that way. Um, obviously, two days ago I was pretty upset after that game here, so um, you know, to, to get the call last night's all turned around pretty quickly, so obviously I'm over the moon at the moment and looking forward to tomorrow. Was it not strictly speaking a local, but the opportunity to perhaps make a debut for Australia at Adelaide Oval? Yeah, I mean, that's worked out perfectly. Um, you know, playing here in the Big Bash and, you know, throughout my first class career, it's been been amazing. Um, the crowd here is always always behind you, so yeah, if I can manage to get a game tomorrow, I'm sure it'll be no different. You seem to have taken another step this year. Is there anything you can put that down to? Uh, I'm not sure. I think maybe just another year of, of first class career under, under the belt and a bit more confidence maybe with a few performances. So I think um, you know, most young blokes, it takes a few years to really uh, feel confident in your own ability and you know you put a couple of good games together and, and, and that's what happens so it's been a really good year so far. Any indication yet if you're going to get a run? Uh, I've only just really met Mickey about an hour ago so I haven't had you know much t to talk to him about yet so um, I'm sure we've got a training run after this so I'm sure um, you know, the more time I spend around the boys I'll probably learn a bit more but um, at the moment I'm just uh, enjoying enjoying this yeah. Were you expecting a call at all with the way you've been going? Uh, no, I've, I'm, I mean a few blokes have been joking about it, but um, to be honest, no, I'd, I was looking forward to a couple of weeks off from um, after the big bash and missing out in the finals. So I thought, you know, two weeks between that and the next shield game. So uh, yeah, it all happened pretty quick last night. Late last night, I got a call, and um, yeah, here I am now. So it's happened pretty fast. Not a bad holiday with the Australian team. Yeah, that's right, isn't it? It's not really a holiday when it's in your own city, though, is it? So uh, no, I was, yeah, I'm really happy to get the call and. Um, yeah, looking forward to tomorrow. How different is the approach between bowling four overs and obviously you need a few different tricks in your kit bag to maybe a little bit more conservative as a one-day bowler? Yeah, I, I think it's all pretty relative. Uh, you know, it's all pretty similar. I think, you know, one-day career is just uh, obviously a longer version of 2020. I mean, you try and swing the new ball early and then at the death you just try and bowl your Yorkers and, and slow balls and stuff like that. But it's just doing it for six overs more, I guess. So, um, I haven't played one-day career for a couple of months now. So. Um, Looking forward to getting back into it. Um, you know, if you can if you can um, execute as well as you can in 2020, then you know the results should go the same. You've got some good one-day form, mate. Yeah, it's been good this year. Um, you know, we, we've been pretty good in in one-day career with the Redbacks. So um, you know, we've got a pretty solid game plan together, and just being a part of that and knowing my role and and managed to take a few wickets here and there. So it's been really enjoyable. If you do get the nod, TV ratings will go through the roof in the territory, do you reckon? Oh, they might, yeah. Um, uh, yeah, I've been hearing a bit from people back up there, so um, yeah, definitely. I think yeah, from yeah, I've obviously come a long way since then, so they'd, they'd be pretty proud. But yeah, we've got to wait and see if I'll get a game first. How will the news be if you do? Yeah, I don't reckon I'll get much sleep tonight either way. I think um, I'm pretty bad at the best of times. So um, yeah, I mean that's what it's like at the start of anyone's career, I guess. So I'm looking forward to it. And um, tomorrow, if uh, yeah, obviously you've proved yourself at the death. If you get the ball. 46, 48, 50, how would you feel about that? Uh, yeah, I think that's probably the kind of role I'll, I'll probably be chucked the ball to do something like that again. But as I said, it's probably no different to what I've been doing for the last month in the Big Bash and with the Redbacks before. So, um, yeah, I think, yeah, as I said, that's probably the role I have to do. So, you know, it's going to be tough, but you just try and tell yourself it's, you know, it's no different to what you've been doing. So, I mean, you've done it well enough to get yourself here. So I think that's just what I've got to keep telling myself. How's the batting coming on, mate? Uh, yeah, I haven't done much of it, to be honest. Um, obviously, in the Big Bash, you just try and slog as hard as you can, so I haven't, haven't been doing much batting, but yeah, hopefully I don't really get an opportunity tomorrow. <laughs> um, we'd better just one more, yeah, mm. you're still dining out in that catch? Uh, yes I am, yeah, I'm living off that at the moment, mum and dad keep getting calls from everyone as well and they're loving the attention, so uh, yeah, I made it look a bit better than it was, but um, yeah, I'll keep living on that one for a while. And that hit wicket, was that the one of the bizarre yeah. moments you've had? In uh, yeah, I watched a replay the other day and I I couldn't believe what happened. Like, I genuinely didn't know that I did it, and looking back, I look like a bit of a goose now because it was clearly out. So um, I'd never been involved in that before, and I think you know, not only the players but the whole ground all know the rules now. That if you hit wicket, you have to appeal. So I'm sure that won't happen again. Is that weird though? You have to appeal like stuff are over. Yeah, oh, that's right. I mean, that's like any dismissal, isn't it? If it's out, it's out. So um, I'm sure everyone will be appealing their heads off from now on.